Vintage here. Welcome back to my channel, my beautiful, amazing Funko friends. So guys, oops, I did it again. We have two more Freddy Funkos that you guys really seem to enjoy. Last week we'll be diving into, so you know what? Why wait? Why keep the suspense? Let's dive into another two Freddy Funkos, guys. So again, I don't know which ones these are. I just know that they're Freddy Funkos. So let's go with the smaller one first, and we'll go with the bigger one next. So this one's got a little bit of a little bit of a crinkle in the corner, but hopefully it's in a protector, or hopefully there's some sort of paper or bubble wrap protecting it. I don't think, it's not too badly smashed, but right there in the corner, so I just hope that, I hope that it wasn't affected. Uh, let's actually cut it open from the bottom. Hopefully it wasn't affected, uh, the pop at all. So again, I don't know what Freddy Funko this is, guys, so we got two more this week, so let's see which ones these are. Okay, whew. Okay, there's plenty of space, it's not too tight, and I feel bubble wrap. So, show you guys first. Alright, let's take the bubble wrap off. Okay, all I see so far is Freddy Funko, Funko Shop exclusive. That's all I see. So I still don't know which one yet. You guys probably see it, but I do not. Alright, no protector, but it is bubble wrap, so that's good. Alright, so it's a Funko Shop exclusive. Let's see which one did we get, guys. Hey, okay, so this is, I believe this is called the Hipster Freddy. Um... I could be wrong, but it's the Hipster Freddy, I believe, because it's got the glasses and it's got the pop sign. So, very cool. So, pristine, minty fresh, extra crispy, no dents, dings, or any sort of inconsistencies that I can see. So, this is officially Freddy Funko, number six in the collection, guys. So, number six, the Hipster, what I'm going to call him, the Hipster Freddy Funko. So, awesome sauce. So, thankfully, it was bubble wrap, no damage, no protector, but that's okay. At least it arrived in good condition. Okay, let's go with this bigger box here. So... Again, guys, this will be Freddy Funko number seven. Yep, number seven. So again, I don't know which one this is. I don't know what Freddy we're going to get, but I do know it will be a Freddy. So, like usual, guys, if you collect Freddy Funkos, let me know which ones you have down below. Let me know which one is your favorite. And when I pull this seventh one, this next one, let me know if you guys have either of these Freddy Funkos. And as well, let me know if there's Freddy Funkos that you have purchased, or if you're looking to purchase, or even so, what is a desired Freddy Funko that you would like to obtain for your set, for your collection? I would sure love to know. Oh, no. We got packing peanuts, guys. If you've been with my channel for a while, you know that I just love packing peanuts. Yay. Alright, so thankfully, thankfully this person didn't stick it in the packing peanuts because packing peanuts could get into the box, could could get all over the window and everything. So thankfully, they were kind of smart about it, I guess. It could have been bubble wrap, but it's in a Walmart bag. So at least the popcorn isn't like... At least it was protected from the popcorn, I guess I should say. Alright, so I... Alright. Oh, wow. Okay, I spoke too soon because they bubble wrapped it in the Walmart bag, so okay, I gotta give them an A for effort on that one. So again, I still can't see which one it is, I just see Funko Shop exclusive, so you guys can probably see it once I get this bubble wrap off. So again, no protector, but that's okay, at least it was protected from the peanuts, from the Walmart bag. Okay, so I'm trying to do this very gingerly, very gently. So. Funko Shop exclusive number 7 is all I see. So we've got... Hey, okay, so this is the Freddy Funko with Ray Gun, I believe. It's not the astronaut. He does have the astronaut helmet. But it's the Freddy Funko with Ray Gun. He's wearing, like, the blue or, like, greenish teal. I'm going to call it teal. He's wearing the teal suit. So we got the Funko Shop exclusive number 7. It's kind of ironic because this is my 7th Freddy Funko. I did not plan that. So we got the 7th Freddy Funko in my collection, the Funko Shop exclusive Freddy with Ray Gun. Number 6, we got the Hipster Freddy. So again, let me know, do you have either of these Freddies in your collection? Which Freddies do you have in your collection? Which Freddies are your favorite? Which Freddy are you wanting to acquire? Or what is a desired Freddy? Or what Freddy Funkos have you purchased that you're looking forward to add to your collection into your home? So let me know down below, guys. As always, number six, number seven. And I'll tell you right now, we're not done yet. We have some more coming in the mail. So I hope you enjoyed us diving into these next two Freddy Funkos into my collection. I sure enjoyed it, so another episode in the books of Dancer TV made me do it. Danny Gilbert, my amazing Funko friends. I'm going to link the video down below that started it all. So big shout out to my Funko friends for having me dive down the Freddy Funko wormhole. So I hope that you guys liked today's video, guys. If you did, make sure to smash that like button. If you aren't already subscribed to me, make sure to hit the subscribe button. And I will see you guys in the next episode, and I will see you guys a week from now, and we'll dive into maybe another two Freddy Funkos. Stay tuned to find out, guys. As always, Mikey Ventus here, signing off. I love all your faces, guys. Happy hunting. Collect what you love. Enjoy the thrill of the hunt. And until the next episode, guys, Mikey Mitch is saying bye, guys. Bye-bye.